Right, I'm gonna review this. My I'm commentary. A but I know what it feels like to be pushed around by overconfident survivors. So I hopped on a level one account and played four games, pretending to be a baby nurse just to see if I can get these arrogant Swifts to troll me. Little did they know I was the one trolling them. The goal was to see if they would react to an unskilled nurse by teabagging and obnoxiously clicking their flashlights. But eventually, I would surprise them with the truth concerning what they were really up against. To make things even more challenging, I wasn't using any perks or add-ons. I did encounter some high-level players who were using meta perks, and I even managed to kill a blatant hacker along the way. Stick around to the end of the video so you don't miss the best parts. Game 1 was on Coldwind Farms, Game 2 was on Macmillan Estate, Game 3 was on Mount Ormond, and Game 4 was on Crotus Prent Asylum. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy what you see, and let me know in the comments if you think what I did was ethical or not. Either way, this was done to avenge all my fellow nurses out there who have been bullied, so let's get into it. Alright, so from the start, basically, oops, let me make this bigger. Um, we would just have to change the game one, game two, game three, game four to uh, the appropriate ones. And possibly instead of putting game one, maybe just put the names of the maps um, instead. So that way it's less confusing as the video goes on. Uh, one thing I wish was in the video, <clears throat> in the intro, this is a good clip. I would surprise them. With um, the clip that um, where I grabbed <clears throat> one of them off the window on Macmillan. So um, possibly adding it in somewhere. And obnoxiously clicking their flashlights. But eventually I would surprise them with the truth concerning what they were really up against. That That's a good clip that showing the spin. To make things even more challenging, I wasn't using any perks or add-ons. I did encounter some high-level players. I think where it says, but I was the one trolling them, which was right here baby nurse just to see if I can get these arrogant Swifts to troll me. Little did they know I was the one trolling them. Uh, that's a good one, but maybe that could have been the one where she gets grabbed off the window. Little did they know I was the one trolling them and then I grab her off the window. The to see maybe it would be a better clip for that spot. I think it's the same girl in the same game. Anyway, let's move along. Either that or it can be added somewhere over here. Let me know in the comments if you you think what I did was ethical or not. Because, like, <clears throat> this is okay, breaking the wall. Either way, this was done. It's kind of interesting, although there's no real action here. But revenge all my fellow nurses out there who have been um, bullied. So let's get into it. So maybe, maybe put it here, like after um, she teabags, and then it shows me grab her off the wall and s instead of just a. Uh, so let's get in. I don't know. Because you don't really see that second, hey, this, you don't really see the second tea bag that much. This was done to avenge all my fellow nurses out there who have. You see those tea bags? Have been bullied. So let's get in. And maybe the hit where she's a. Uh, maybe right here, put that other hit that was before, where where she actually got hit. I should be doing this with actual video, come to think of it, because I can't skip through it with the uh, with the YouTube video, so yeah. I can't really skip through it as uh frame by frame. So let me just download it really quick. But maybe this hit right here could be at the end there after she teabags at the end of the intro. Or is it right? To avenge all my fellow nurses he or she teabags out there who have and then it shows me hit her with that other hit. And, and then the one where she gets grabbed off the window would be like back here where it says little did they know I was the one trolling them. It should be like back here. Bull me. Little did they know I was the one trolling them. Like that hit should be towards the end after she teabags. The goal was but this right here should probably be when I when it says I was trolling them, I grab her off the window. Let me check the video. It's still downloading. I'll, I'll keep going on and then I'll switch over to it. But let's start. So let's start where it's um, the video starts, right? If you stick around for this game. So once again, you're going to have to match the names here. If you do change this to Macmillan Estate. Or maybe you have game two and have. 
I don't know. Maybe you have game two and you actually have the, the, the map under it. If you did, you'd have to make it small so where it, it fits. You know, you don't want it to be too big and noticeable. So you'd have to make the game two size is good. But if you were to change it to the, to the map, because Macmillan Estate is a much longer word, you don't want it to be going so long. You'd ha actually have to squash the size of it down. So I don't know what would be best. I'll show you what I'm doing. <clears throat> All right, so let's see. This is almost done. No, it's not almost done. <coughs> and kind of right. testing the survivors to see if they're going to be toxic, thinking that it's a baby nurse, because <coughs> people bully a baby nurse. Let me get some they water. see a baby nurse, and they're like, oh, this, this is fair game. We can just shine our flashlights at her and teabag and all that stuff. So let's test so right there when i say shine our flashlights you can just shine our flash shine our flashlights at and teabag right there out. you could you should leave the audio but you should show a clip of them teabagging and clicking their flashlights you leave this audio because there's no nurse blink here so you can leave this audio Maybe nurse and they're like oh was that blink that this part you have to keep because it has the sound of the nurse blink and it will sound weird to hear the nurse blink without the sh without showing it because i'm just starting off this, this is fair but right game. here shine this clip you could show somebody shine their flashlight or uh oh hold on a minute Got another tab open um Okay, so like I said, this clip sh could show it because right here it's like slow starting and you're not seeing anything yet. No action. But what I'm explaining, you could show it on the screen. Flashlights at her and tea bag and all that stuff. Like, see, there's nothing here. So let's test them first. First, so we play like a baby. We do baby nurse things. We lose chases. So I'm going to chase them for a minute and then I'm going to leave. Go somewhere else. Like, we'll vault the window. Okay. Now, this part where I say I'll vault the window, that's kind of important because a nurse would never vault a window. A nurse just blinks through windows. She doesn't have to vault them. So, that's definitely a baby nurse thing. And the, the, the thing here is that it doesn't really show me vaulting the window. I say it and I do it, but you don't really see the window because it happens so, so quickly. Go somewhere else. Right? Right here. So... You probably want to like show a little earlier where uh, where you actually see me walking up to the window and vaulting it. Like we'll vault the window. So you can't really see from this perspective that I vaulted a window, even though I said it. It should show me walking up to the window and vaulting it because, like I said, a nurse, a a real nurse would never bother vaulting a window. You just blink right through the window. Okay, so let me actually go to the video now show in folder okay now let me skip forward to where we were just at and now she's seen maybe he'll and i'm i am find me oh like we'll vault the and then right there. i'm gonna leave go somewhere else and i'm also gonna lower this volume just to make sure it doesn't get louder than my voice which we can check right here. Like we'll vault the window. He's gonna blind me. Good check, shot. check, check. Okay. He's gonna repeatedly blind me over and over again. Oh, isn't he a nice guy? I'm just gonna swing at the air, and he's just gonna keep blinding me. And I'm so lost. He's blinding me like 600 times. I don't even know what to do. Maybe he'll get his friends to blind me too. Oh, she's going to try too. She's like, oh, that's a baby nurse. We could keep blinding her over and over again. She can't even see. She's just going in circles. And now she's running around in circles. Doesn't even know how to blink. And I'll just blind her again. Oh man, this is so mean. Let's come over here and hit this one down first. Stop her from popping again. I'll just get blinded again. Oh, we'll just swing at the air. I don't know what to do with this bully squad. I'm gonna run after them on foot. Oh, and just accidentally down her. Not even trying to. 
And then we'll go for him and we'll try to blink and we'll just hit the wall and... And we don't even know what we're doing. We'll just have to break it old-fashioned way. Are you running out of beamer juice yet, buddy? Okay, all that was good. Uh, there's a lot of blinding, but it, it really gets the point across. So right here, there's a sound of a blink for some reason, which is a little weird. Or like an explosion or something. Running out of beamer juice yet, buddy? And it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but it just kind of abruptly comes in and sounds like, what was that sound? It just doesn't belong there. Uh, let's see this. Oh, you got me looping around cow tree. I don't even know what to do. I'll try to blink. And I'll just run into the wall. I don't know what I'm doing. Hello, sir. Oh, no. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying to blink, but I just don't know how. Oh, I hit a tree. Don't hit me with the pet. Oh, dead hard. Nice dead hard. <laughs> okay, all this is pretty good. I, I think the Jane crouching there is, is pretty funny. The oh, dead hard. Nice. Like the Jane crouching at the door right there. It would kind of be funny to like zoom in on her and have like a like a question mark like what is this but you don't have to i just i just see it and i'm like what is she doing there just crouching at the door but anyway you don't have to bring attention to it i just think it would be funny like real nice dead hard get that flashlight point ready get it it might break the flow of what happened to to do that but just an idea because when i see it i'm like what what is she doing like urban evasioning yeah you got it actually did, she doesn't look like she had urban evasion because she was moving too slow but it just looks silly <clears throat> that's why i think she was in on it because she was hanging around um <clears throat> later on in the video when i kill her I say, oh, you know, I think you were in on it. I think Jane was in on it. Um, <clears throat> why was she creeping around him? Like, maybe then it could uh, clip back to that little clip right there in black and white that shows, like, you know, her creeping by the door or something. Maybe, possibly. Dad, oh, look at you. Then you think you got it, but it's something you already had. Okay, that whole part could probably just be taken out for sake of making the video shorter because all it's showing is just me like running around in circles really quickly, singing badly. So it doesn't really need to be there. Uh, maybe if you wanted to do um, a very quick one that takes out the singing and just has like some kind of zoom like sound real fast, like. Two, two or three seconds just like zoom. that's it right there like real quickly and then it just gets right to the point where i'm at the palette right here like a very quick zip around with some sound effect uh you did it in the other video one of the um hold on a second one of these videos this one prophet you are so sweet that was so nice um it's just game it was i love, I love a nerd so <laughs> we were just saying how uh, um i don't know it was somewhere <coughs> man scratchy throat okay so somewhere he did this effect which was kind of funny in this video that that was it right there you want me come get me <laughs> something like that maybe would would be cool for this little section oh i'm on the wrong video again i need to just close this down Comments, comments, more comments. We're back here. Okay, so zooming. Oh no! What are you so for that, maybe right here, instead of the singing, just a quick like, ah, very short, two seconds, three seconds. Oh no! What are you gonna do? You're just gonna use all your flashlight. Keep this. Just swing at the air. 
I'm such a baby. I will let him get the flash. Okay. Up to there, right when I said I'm such a baby with the reverb, that was good. Doing it the air. I'm such a baby. And the video will be shorter by this point. We're at three minutes. It'll be shorter if you cut out that section I said. But right here, this can probably be cut out to I don't think this needs to be here coming up right here. This this can be cut. We'll let him get the flashlight save. Where is he at? No, he's around. All this can be cut. We'll see. How fast can you get this flashlight save, Leon? This is not important here, none of this. There he is. Let's just go after him. Okay, you can come back in right... Right about... Let's pretend like... Here. But let's pretend like I can't get to the hook. Let's pretend like, oh, I can't hook. Oh, no. Uh, just come back in there. So maybe when he shines the flashlight at me right here. Let's just go after him. Right about. Maybe here, come in. Or. Don't even really need that, maybe. Maybe that. Or you can come in right here when I said, let's just pretend. Let's pretend like or oh, let's pretend I like I can't. Hook. Oh no! Yeah, the hook's broken. What am I gonna do? I can't. Uh, the only thing weird about that is it doesn't show me hit the Jane down, right? So it doesn't really show that I got it down, other than her just laying there. Wing at the air. I'm such a baby. I will I'll let him get the flashlight save. Because it doesn't show me pick her up. Where is he at? Uh, maybe you could leave that part where I said let him get the flashlight save. Something that shows her on the floor or getting hit down real quick. So yeah, then then it cuts it to locker, you can so cut all this. Fast can you get this flashlight save? This is all a waste of time right here. Locker. There he is. Uh, okay, maybe come back in right there. There he is. Like maybe do the part where it says uh wing at the air. I'm such a baby. Maybe right when it says We'll let him get the flashlight save. And get the flashlight save. Uh, where is he? Where is he at? And then cut right to where he says, there he is. There he is. Let's just go after him. Yeah, you could leave this then. Just cut out that section where it's just wasting time before that. Let's pretend like, oh, I can't hook. Oh, no. The hook's broken. What am I going to do? I can't hook. She's right there. I'm going to go on foot. And like come after her like and then i'll just like do a bad blink and whiff all right so here um i'm just saying like too much it's all right but i'm just kind of yapping so when it says uh the hook's broken what am i gonna do i can't hook she's right there I'm she's right there i'm gonna foot. go on foot right there you can cut the audio and skip, leave out this next part of the audio after I say I'm going to go on foot and like come after her like I can cut all that out and then resume right here when I say I'm going to go on foot and then it'll go and then I'll just like do a bad blink and whiff. and then I'll just do a bad blink and whiff and you can instead of having it cut like you can cut the audio there to cut out a section but then you could just pull back this video a little bit so it's all one smooth video and it doesn't have a video cut here go on foot and like come after her like if you get what i'm saying like you can cut out this audio the cut out this chunk of the section here where i'm just saying like too much so it'll say i'm gonna go on foot and then i'll blink and miss and it'll be a shorter clip and then you can just pull back the video to to fill in the gap where it uh gets cut out and then i'll just like do a bad blink and whiff right there and then the clip should probably end right there and then I'll just leave. I'll just drop that yeah, chase. Yeah, that's fine. Play silly. She ran this way. We'll just... Ch See, another thing I do <coughs> is I shave off like little seconds by making cuts faster. Go on so foot. it's like I'll go on foot and then it cuts right to... And then I'll just leave. Go I, on I can't uh, go forward, but go on foot. foot and like come after her. Cut like, all this out. And then I'll... And then I'll just, just like do a bad blink and whiff right there. And then right when that happens, right when I whiff, right after I whiff and it makes the noise. 
I mean, yeah, you cut it fine. I just, I, I just, sometimes I cut off. Usually when I'm making shorts, I cut them like very tight to cut off like a second here or a half a second there. And then when I'm making shorts, it all adds up when I cut off little seconds, but in a longer video, it's probably fine. And then I'll just leave. I'll just, just drop that chase. So right there, after I say chase, right there is immediately where I would cut. Play silly. See, you went on for like a half a second or a second. It's not a big deal at all, but I'm just telling you my mindset when I'm editing is usually like very tight cuts. As soon as it can be cut, I cut it. Whiff, and then I'll just leave. I'll just drop that chase. Right there, drop that chase. That's where I would cut it. And then, so what you have is like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So you had like a whole nother like 24 frames there. And like I said, not a big deal in a video like this. It's fine. But I'm telling you my mindset of, especially when I'm doing shorts is I would cut off all those frames. And, but if you do that, you have to make sure the audio doesn't get cut off either. So you would extend the audio out or make sure you put a fade, make sure the audio smooth, but the video, a lot of times I edit the audio first. I chop up the video based on the audio and I create the whole audio. And then I go in and fix all the video to, to match and line up. Like I'm editing the audio and the video at the same time, but I'm not concerned about what I'm cutting in the video. I'm all concerned a lot of times about what I'm cutting in the audio and the video looks all jumbled up. It just goes together. But then I go in and clean up the video by deleting sections and dragging sections longer in the beginning or the end of the clip to like make all the cuts look smooth. But a lot of times I focus on the audio first. Anyway, that's more about shorts. Like I said, don't worry about that really here. Play silly. She ran this way. Just wanted just to give you a tip. Foot. Oh, she did a tea bag. A little, a little tea bag. A little blind. See, I knew this would bring it out of her. Come on. I want her to build up her con. So like that, <coughs> like that little part right there. A little, a little tea bag. A little blind. A little blind. See, All right. So when I say right here, see, I knew this would bring it out of her. Yeah, I knew this would bring it out of her. Come on. I okay. So that clip per se like the audio is good just like that but i would probably show another v clip of her taunting me over that audio because there's like where you're not seeing anything you're just seeing me walk a little a little tea bag see like that's good a little blind see i knew this would bring it out of her come on I that see that little section like it could just show something else I want her to build up her confidence same here start becoming a bully yeah, like that whole section there, the audio is fine because I'm talking and I'm saying what I want to do, but maybe there's other parts in the video where it shows her doing it more, or maybe you repeat the same parts like zoomed in or in slow motion or in black and white to emphasize what she's doing to really like show the point that she's teabagging. So you could we ran this way. We'll just chase on foot. <clears throat> See that little part where it says she ran this way. That's kind of pointless. Doesn't really need to be there, yeah, but it's okay. Leave. I'll just drop that chase. I'll just drop that chase. Play silly. She Play silly. Okay, way. that's fine. That's fine. We'll just chase on foot. We'll just chase on foot. Okay, this little part here where oh, she does she a tea bag and a blind. Bag. If there's nothing else to use, like there's no other clips of her like tea bagging, then maybe reuse this. But little, you could even pull the clip little, of her tea bagging somewhere else. Little tea and right here tea when bag, i say a little blind right see, here when i, I say see i knew all this right here i want her all this right here could be showing a close-up of her tea bagging and blind you know something that makes it more interesting that like really just emphasizes like this is what she's doing she's being obnoxious and we're like really showing that she's being obnoxious plus it's better to look at than just me walking around doing nothing like that's the mindset of like when I'm editing, I'm trying to think of stuff like that. anything like this. I'm just walking around. I try not to have it. I try to have something more interesting there. Um, sometimes it's okay. You get away with it, but it's really so much better to just always keep them looking at something. Start becoming a bully. I don't know what, Hey, you, she's right back on it. That's very bold of you, Kate. Very bold of you. How dare you do that right in the face of a baby nurse? How dare you? 
All right, unfortunately, Leon's gonna have to die because they're down to two gens and somebody else. Okay, so right here. All right, unfortunately. <coughs> right here when I start killing Leon, maybe this shouldn't be here. Maybe this should be later on in the video when I've already turned into, uh, like, you know, revealed that I'm not a baby nurse. Maybe. Because what you could hear is what you uh, what you could do here is just switch to another video like the next video and save this part for later because the other thing we don't want to do is let these go on for very long in the same spot doing the same thing so <clears throat> the first one on this map went on for very long but it kind of works because they're constantly bullying me and blinding me so it really like goes on for a bit but now we're here and this has gone on for a bit and maybe the clip where i kill leon shouldn't be here i'm not sure about that i have to see how the rest of the video flows but let's just watch the view all right unfortunately leon's gonna this might be better off a little later but we'll see i have to die because they're down to two gens and somebody has to go and he's on death hook so and honestly, I do feel bad killing a lot of people in this game, and I let a lot of people live. We we'll just ignore her. <clears throat> so she gets very bold. The good thing is they're not on gens. Look, she's teabagging me. I'll give her a flashlight blind. This should be like a big shot. Look. See, like that part where she's teabagging could have been used to zoom in and slow motion oh. or black and white or something. Flashlight blind. Uh. Bold. In the earlier section, I was talking about where you needed more footage of that. Good thing that could have been that could be used if you need it, like right there. Maybe like zoomed in close, so it's like takes up a lot of the screen. You see her up close, teabagging. Uh, I'm trying to still see how this flows with the clip of the guy of him dying. A lot of people in this game, and I let a lot of people live. We we'll just ignore her, so she gets very bold. The good thing is they're not on gens. Look, she's teabagging me. I'll give her a flashlight blind. This should be like a big shot. Look, oh, she flashlight blinded me. Oh no, she got to save. Whatever shall I do now? She is building her confidence. Look, they're trying to body block. I guess the Leon clip of him dying belongs in that order because over on the left, you see that somebody's dead, that they're killed already. So it would be weird to put take it out of place here. So maybe it just stays there. Unless this entire section got moved further back, but I'm still kind of trolling here as a baby, so I guess it should probably just stay. They're getting bold and brave. Look, I can't. Oh, there we go. I got her. They'll unhook in my face, too. Watch. Come on. Unhook in my face. You know you want to. There you go. Unhook in my face. And I'll go after the Kate. Like, I'm so bad, I just have to tunnel. I'm going to go for the Kate. Stop teabagging me, Thalita. Stop. Okay, so uh, on retrospect, hindsight, whatever you want to call it, I guess that makes sense because you don't want to take it out of order in that case with him dying. So scratch that. Forget about that. Keep going forward. Oh, okay. That was a, a edit that I thought was really good because I go into fatigue and wake up on a different map is a nice uh, transition. Stop teabagging me, Thalita. Stop. Oh, okay, they did the far gen. Let's see if we can hang. We have no perks, no add-ons. He did his little teabaggy thing at me. Oh, and he's there in front. Okay. Act like a baby. Okay, little baby moves. Well, act like we don't know how to blink through the rock. We'll take you, even though you'll probably wiggle out. Yeah, you got boil over. All right, that's good. I want you to get out. We'll drop down here. We'll give you all that wiggle, and then we'll pretend like we can't get you to the hook, and you're going to wiggle out. So, actually, what might make, might make more sense is taking this... No, it's not going to work because of that transition. Your transition was too good. I don't want to mess that up. All right, never mind. Keep going. Uh, Where's the hook? Oh no, I can't find- I was gonna say to move this earlier, before Leon died, but the transition was too good where you, uh, that I just spoke of a minute ago, so. And a hook, where is it? Oh, oh no, he got out. Let's put her on a hook. 
Okay, so now the music changes and things are different. Um, <clears throat> a little pressure. Uh, I wonder um, if there's another way we can emphasize that like things are changing now. Because we're six minutes in. Six, almost seven minutes in. Um, which will actually be probably a little shorter if you take out a few of those parts. Just a little shorter. Um, I'm wondering if there's a way we can emphasize that things are going to change now. But the music might be good enough. And when I, s I actually say, let's get a little pressure. Keep going. Put let's her go. on a hook. Let's get a little pressure going. That's probably oh, fine. Squad. Are you ready for what? Uh, one thing that was bothering me, which I don't know why it was like that, but it's the little thing when I hook Let's people. Get a little pressure going. In the upper left corner here. Oh, Beamer Squad. The little blue uh, challenge that pops up. It's just, it's weird how it pops up, but then it immediately vanishes. And I guess that's because the clip got cut. But maybe you can cut the clip before like right here before it shows up and pull back the other video it's it's not a big deal but for me like i see things like that and they just kind of like distract me little things that pop up on the screen for a second or flash and my eyes don't even have time to really register or read them it to me it's like a distraction it's like why is that even there but i get it <clears throat> that it happens in the game it's just part of the game so you can't always get rid of that stuff but i try to edit around that as much as possible because i notice in this video a couple of times that pops up and it just vanishes really quickly so i would either try to hide it all together or possibly let it linger a little longer so it's so at least it seems like there's a reason for having it there. But watch how quickly it happens when I hook her and then it just cuts. Like I said, maybe I would cut the video right there before it happens and skip to the Leon sooner because you're only losing like a few frames anyway. Might as well just cut that off. Let's get a little pressure going. <clears throat> Man. Oh, Beamer Squad. I just woke up what's about a little while ago, on? so my, yeah. I'm like all you better run. We got some froggy and here. Might as well pick her up. Didn't brush my teeth. Two and three have been hooked. Once. See, it happened again. It happened again on that hook. Watch, here. it just Might flickers well for a second in the top left. Two and three have been hooked. Which is this one's weird because it doesn't even look like there's a cut in the video, unless I'm missing something. It almost doesn't look like there's a cut there. But see that? Like she gets hooked and I turn right and it pops up on the screen. And then it just disappears and it doesn't even look like the video's cut. So I don't know if that's just how it was in the game. Maybe it was like that in the game. It just seems weird how it flickers so quickly. If there's a way you can hide those little things, go for it. If it seems too complicated or it's not worth the effort and the time, then don't worry about it. Like I said, for me, little things like that just seem just feel like a dis distraction because they happen so quickly and you just wonder like, why, what did I just see? Why was that there? Now, granted, the average viewer is never going to care. It's just me being picky. But that's me as like a perfectionist editor, like just trying to make things as pleasant and perfect as possible to look at. We got someone slugged here. Might as well pick her up. Two and three have been hooked once. Come on, Leon. I'm going to get you now. I think it's time to kick it into gear now. We don't want to. All right, hold on, let me back up just a little bit. I did say there it's time to kick it into gear, so that's fine. Sorry, Come little on, pause, Leon. okay. Two and three have been- So hooked. there's a little flicker. Come on, Leon, I'm gonna get you now. That's fine. I think it's time to kick it into gear now. We don't want to see like that right there. When I said, I think it's time to kick it into gear now. I think it's this. Time to... oh, okay. So it shows me going to fatigue. Kick it.
could probably cut the video right here. Maybe. Come on, like Leon. right after. Um, I'm gonna get you now. Well, let me see. I think it's no. Okay, I guess it works because I go into fatigue. But it's time to kick it into gear. Maybe right here, I would cut the video, leave the audio, and cut to the second clip sooner that comes up right here. You know, we don't want to. No, it's fine. It's fine. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Take it for granted. I was just trying to eliminate that one little clip where I'm like just not doing anything right here, but it kind of needs to stay because of the fatigue. It will just sound weird to hear the fatigue and not see like the nurse going into fatigue. I try to keep the audio matching with the video as best as possible. I think it's time to kick it into gear now. This is fine. I don't want to take it for granted or underestimate the gen speed i'm always looking for those one those little edits that'll just make everything flow even smoother but they're not always there it's sometimes it's best to leave things alone <coughs> yeah come on bring your flashlight over here what works on the baby nurses you get in your mmr um that right there you could possibly show me pick, picking up, picking her up, but it really probably doesn't matter because you see me down her. Is it going to work here? Like if you did show me pick her up, you would leave the audio the same and just insert a clip there right after she gets down yeah, Come on, bring like your that flashlight. instead of wiping the blade here, maybe over here. or never mind maybe like right here instead of all this walking as you leave the the audio you could just show the pickup real quick the clip of the pickup what works on the and then baby. it will just pick resume right here like you could just insert the little pickup clip not a big deal but for sake of flow is like i do stuff like that the nurses you get in your mmr is it gonna work here oh she's dead already uh-oh See that? Oh, she's dead already. Oh, that's fine. Uh oh. Surprise, mother lover. I think all this is fine. She DCs. Oh, she DC'd. And follow him. And come like oh, the two we'll spin blinks. Are you gonna flashy at me? Are you gonna keep clicking your flashy at me? The Jane crouching once again. That's so funny. All she's doing is just crouching around. Hi, right, Jane. It's she you been all my life? Playing like such a noob. Surprise. That, uh, let me see. Hi, right, Jane. Where have you been all my life? That's fine, I think. Yeah. You cut off the charge to the blink, but that's fine, because it would take too long to show that and be pointless. Surprise, Jane. You see him moonwalking. Hi. Jane. Jane. Jane has done nothing wrong. Jane can escape this. See that right there where I said Jane has done nothing wrong? Jane. Jane. Jane, Jane has done no nothing wrong. Like this, the audio is good. Jane has done nothing wrong. But you could have had this clip already showing. Like pull this clip back farther so you already see me chasing her. Like this point uh this clip of me saying jane has nothing jane has done nothing wrong the audio is good there's no point for the visual right jane. uh this is fine jane. that's fine but right here this video this visual doesn't need to be here jane has done nothing oh uh, you can kind of see her on the right but wrong jane. it would be better to have this vid this clip already showing over that audio if that makes sense jane can escape this match she's done nothing wrong <laughs> You're not the one that I want, Jane. It's this guy. What are we doing, Leon? What are we doing? What are we doing, Leon? Mm. So, right here. You're not the one that I want, Jane. It's this guy. This is fine. Okay, right here, this cut.
all this right here could probably be taken out to right there when he crosses the window maybe and i say what are we doing can come back in right here because this is a little waste of time like right here is fine there's a cut like all this right here is kind of just a waste of time like nothing's being said and i'm just you know lurking around looking for him it shows him go by the window but it's not that important it could show him right there what are we doing leon what are we doing what are we doing leon mm, good reflex something about that little section is a little too long good reactions my boy are we just gonna stay at shack is that what we're gonna do i try it again Jane, Jane, why are you? Yeah, so just something about that where I'm like with him at Shaq, something in there is just a little too long and it loses interest. I think it's just when I'm looking around and nothing's happening or being said. So that could be cut a little shorter. Probably where I, probably right around where I said. Uh, let's look at it one more time just to be sure. Like I don't want to tell you an edit and then it's like wrong. So something about like right when he goes in the shack there and then I blink, you could probably cut like right here and leave the audio screech of the nurse, but you could probably cut right here. Probably. There's no point in showing the fatigue really, or that's okay. I, I'd probably cut right about there. It's just a little sooner than you did. And then maybe... Come back right about here when he's crossing the window. What are we doing, Leon? What are we doing? What are we doing, Leon? Mm, good reflex. I know it's only taken off a few seconds. Let's see. So it's time. What's the time on it? Well, the times are going to be different once you start editing, but I just want to count the seconds as 8.44, or, yeah, 8.44 to 8.49. So you cut, like, five seconds off there. I think it'll definitely help the flow of things. What are we doing, Leon? What are we doing? What are we doing, Leon? Mm, good reflex. Good reactions, my boy. Are we just gonna stay at Shack? Is that what we're gonna do? I try it again. Jane. Jane, why are you here? Oh, he's a hacker! <laughs> he's a hacker! Oh, what do you know? He puts his hacks on. No wonder his name is a dot. There you have it, Hacker Exposed. Ah, um, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. He could just crawl out the door. Nothing. Okay, something about that right there, when I'm looking around, feels like you could Hacker. probably <laughs> show... Jane, Jane, why are you here? Right here. You could probably show this again in slow motion and maybe black and white so it shows like a review but he would just be like zipping like that like you would see that oh now he's gone Hacker. <laughs> but you kind of see him over there like possibly show that again or something to make this a little more interesting Hacker. or cut my words even closer so there's no space in between them. Oh, uh, what do you know? And maybe put reverb on them or something to give them an effect, but something that makes it like hacker. it's a hacker, <laughs> haha, and then uh, he's, a, he's a, a hacker, hacker, and then there's no space right here, and it immediately says, "Oh, what do you know?" Oh, uh, what do you know? He puts he his puts hacks hacks on. on, and then there's no space here, and it immediately says the next thing. No wonder his uh, name it does already basically. Name is a dot right there all this there you have <clears throat> so where i said 
No wonder his name is a dot. Exxon. It would just no say his, his name, name is, is a, a dot. dot. There you have it. Like the the words spacings would be closer. Like it would just immediately keep saying the next thing. There you have it. Hacker exposed. Hacker exposed. All this space where is nothing right here. Ah, beautiful. Mm. Could say you could move it closer. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. He could just crawl out the door. Nothing. It's okay. I would just try to shorten that by like bringing the words closer, affecting them, like almost making them overlap each other. Like as I'm ending one phrase, another phrase I'm saying, almost like I'm talking over myself back to back. So it's like, well, if you. A hacker. <laughs> He's a hacker. Oh, uh, what do you know? So it'd be like, Oh, he's a hacker. Ha ha ha. He's a hacker. Oh, what do you know? No wonder his name was a dot. Ah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. He could just crawl out the gate. Nothing I could do about that. You know, like it would all be like very close back to back where it's almost talking over at the end of every word. A new word is coming in. It's almost like two people are talking instead of one. And you could put effects, delays, reverbs, things on it to just make it more interesting. And then you could show the clip of him crawling away. Jane, Jane, why are you here? Right here, like in slow motion, black and white, something to show that like you're not supposed to be sliding on the floor like that. I don't know if slow motion would help because he did it really fast, um, Hacker. but I don't know. I don't know. Something to just make it a little more interesting than me just walking around here. Uh, and that's another reason I would bring all the words closer. So it's a very, it's a much shorter section where we don't drag it on for too long. What do you know? Name is a, uh, see that where I say, ah, like beautiful, beautiful, whatever. Like even that could be coming in. Like the, ah, could be coming in while I'm saying, uh, is a dot. There you have it. Hacker. Okay, so it'd be like hacker exposed. Or so it'd be like name is a dot. dot. There you have it. Hacker exposed. Ah, hacker beautiful, exposed. beautiful, beautiful. It'd be like that. Ah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And some things can be affected while others are not necessarily. They don't all have to have the same effect. But I hope you get what I'm saying. I would just make this part a little more interesting by shortening it overlapping words like me saying ah beautiful is not that important so it can be like coming in the background where i say uh name is a dot right here it'd be like there you have it hacker exposed ah beautiful beautiful ah. beautiful it would have already ha it would have already been said and see how much time we would cut off here beautiful 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 all this would be he cut off crawl out the door then you could say so it'd be like, uh, name is a dot. There you have it. Hacker exposed. So name is a dot. dot. There you have it. There Hacker have exposed. It. Hacker ah, exposed. beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Ah, he could just beautiful, crawl out the beautiful, door. Beautiful. The clip would be over by now. He could just crawl out the door. Nothing. See, we would, sh we would cut off like a lot of seconds, just condensing it all. I could do about that. Not only that part's good. Nothing I could do about that. I'm wondering if the kid should pop up in the entire screen saying it, like filling up the screen, but maybe, I don't know. Wait a minute. Not only go ahead. Not only go ahead. Look at him go. Look at this. Uh, I'm right there. I say not only, and then I like don't finish my thought. Right when they're healing, nothing I could do about that. So right here, when I blink there, you could immediately pull up the kid full screen. Says, "Wait a minute." Wait a minute. And then right after that, it can come right here. Okay. Nothing I, I could do about that. Not only. Yeah, I mean, I would try to cut out not only because I don't really finish my thought. I don't say anything, but I do kind of want to show the part where they're where she's healing him because it shows that she's a participant in it. 
So once again, this clip here where she's healing him could be another part that shows that they're working together. Like in the end, when I kill her and I say, oh, I think you're with him. This is another clip that could be shown that she's healing him and she's like helping him. But anyway, I would try to take out where I said not only because I'm not, I don't really say anything there, but once again, it's not a big idea. Uh, it's not a big deal rather. Um, just little things like that. But I wouldn't want to lose the part where she's healing him. And you don't want to have just dead silence there. Like you, you actually want to have game audio. So if there's a way to edit it where it looks natural and is able to take out what I said, not only, that's fine. If not, not a big deal. Go ahead. Look at him go. Look at the speed. Let's go. Let's keep it going. Watch him run away, fly away. No, no, you get hooked now. Let's see what you can do now. This is all no, fine. James, this is all good. Touching him. He's gonna deliver into my face. Here it is. Come on. Oh no! Wait, what? You couldn't deliverance yourself, stupid? Wow. Hack her down. You know what? I honestly think Jane was in on it. See right here, somewhere over here, like I like showing her on the floor, but also it could show like a little rewind zzz, and then it shows her like creeping around him at Shaq or healing him or something that shows that she was like working with him, maybe. Why was she creeping around right him? here? Right when I say this, because I'm just looking at her body. So you can let me look at her body he here. Was in on it right there. Why and then she, I say, why was she creeping around him? He creeping around him right there. It could show the, the flashback of her around him. I was going to let you live, Jane, but I feel like and then come back to you're this in on this and uh, in anonymous mode, too. All right, that's all good. Take that. Here comes Kate with her flashlight. We've never seen one of those before. Have a seat, Kate. Actually, I think it'd be better to put you on the hook. See, on that one, when she got hooked, the thing in the left corner, the achievement, the challenge, look how long it stayed. Actually, I think it'd be better to put you on the hook. That one's fine because it looks normal. The other ones flickered for a second or for like a fraction of a second and then we're gone. That one looked normal. And back down she goes. I think most of the rest of the video is good, yeah, but we'll go through it. Fast to pretend like we're a baby. Oh, look, Fang is going to do her little tea thingies, are you now? Oh, what are you asking for, Fang? What exactly See are you again? Asking? That time on the hook, it flickered again. So I don't know if that's just the game or if that's an edit, but it didn't even look like an edit. No. But if but if you look at it here. Oh, uh, what are you asking for? Fang? See it flicker and then it vanishes real quick. Fang, what Gone. exactly are you asking? And it didn't even look like an edit. So no. watch again. Oh, uh, what are you asking for, Fang? What exactly are you asking for? You want a little attention? Look how fast they're doing gens. See that okay. right there showing me looking at the ground after the gen popped. Look how fast the, the audio is fine. Look how fast they're doing gens, but like why looking at the ground? They're doing gens. They could already be showing this clip. Like it could be showing a little back farther on this clip. The looking at the ground is unnecessary. Look how fast they're doing right gens. here. That clip could be okay. showing this clip already. Why haven't you left the area? Three gens done. So I would fix things like that. You know, take out the clips that don't need to be there. Bring the other clip sooner. Like just pull it back so you see more of it. If it, it'll flow better. What's going? Not here. I'm talking about this one right here. This clip could be brought back further so it would flow more. Just, just reiterating myself. Just trying to make sure you get it. What I'm saying. Right there, it could already show me start chasing the Claudette from the next clip. Look how fast you can leave the audio the same right here. Fast they're doing gens. Claudette! Why haven't you left the area? 
Three gens done. What's going on here, Kate? Why didn't you uh, get yourself healed up? That's fine. <clears throat> but you can hear her scream. Maybe you could let her scream. Uh, her dying lasts a little longer. Get yourself healed up. The sound of it right here. Like you just hear a little scream and it cuts out. Maybe you can let that. If it works, if I'm not saying anything. It's not bad, but maybe you could let that like be a little louder and last a little longer. What's up, Betty? Ready for your hook? Hello? Oh, it's a tea bagger, is it? See that right there again, looking at the ground? Oh, it's a tea <laughs> Right here, you could probably cut the video a little bit like sooner Bag. instead of just staring at the ground. Where is it? Maybe. Because you do a cut already right here. So you may as well just bring this, drag this earlier and start showing this clip sooner. Because otherwise I'm just looking at the floor. Hello? Oh, it's a tea bag. So right, right about here-ish. You probably cut right here. Where is it? And start the next clip already. This clip. <coughs> oh, surprise. Surprise. <coughs> Let me see. Let me just check that again. Oh, surprise. Surprise. Okay, that's fine because there's no cut. So I look at the floor. So I'm oh, looking at the floor, surprise. but I naturally surprise. look up and it's still the same clip. So that's fine. But if you're going to cut during a... During a... Uh, Hello? See that one? That one works. You see how you cut? Like right there, you cut right about here. Hello? And it's already showing the next oh, clip. It's a tea bagger, is it? But right there. Hello. Like I said, this is not a big deal. I, I would just probably like. Hello? Oh, it's a tea bagger. Right about there ish. Bring in, start the next clip here. Where is it? Because I come out of the fatigue, but then it cuts. So I don't know. Might as well just cut it sooner. Start showing this clip earlier. Oh, surprise. This one's fine because I come out of the fatigue. Same clip. Fatigue again. Same clip. That's perfectly fine. It shows the realisticness of the fatigue and how long. But you see, you did it good there. Like it ended. She gets down and then you pretty much cut right here. No, this is the this is this is the one that continues on. Sorry, it went back too far. This one. Right there, down, and then you cut right about here. So this doing? is all good. What are we doing here? Oh no, what's happening? Well, first of all, I think we need to get rid of this one. Oh, he, oh, all right, beautiful. Beautiful. I like it. All right. So right here is a little confusing because it shows me hook well, first her, all, right? Need to get rid then it shows me one. hook him, but then it comes over here, like right here. You, you should be showing me picking up the fang right here because now I'm carrying fang and you don't even know that I picked her up. Like, like, so it's confusing. You don't realize like that. I even pick someone up. So right there. It should be showing me, you know, like right after I hook him. Well, so it hooks her. All, I think we need to get rid of this one. Right after it hooks him, it probably shouldn't even show me turn around. Like right here, it should show a clip of me picking up Fang. It leave his screams going on. But here, instead of this, should be showing me picking up Fang. And then... Now it cuts to this clip, so you know I'm carrying her as he deliverances himself off the hook. Oh, he, oh, all right, beautiful, beautiful. I like it. I like it a lot. Hi, Sonny. Where's our little tea maker? There you are. I didn't realize she was death hook. 
Certainly this guy will find the hatch. Oh, it's here. Nice. Hello, sir. So, <clears throat> another thing... <coughs> sorry. <clears throat> My voice. Um, another thing is, like, right here, I killed them all. Right? And what I'm thinking is that at the end of every game that concludes me killing them all, maybe show something like all four skulls or the end game the end game screen that shows they're all they all died something that shows like that game is over we're not going to go back to it like so in this case this game is over uh in the game in the game previously or we're at like 13 minutes but in the game previously the the cold wind uh with the hacker way back here right when they die in they're all dead anonymous mode like something that shows just for like two seconds the end Ew. end game with them all dead or something you could show all the skulls that are on the left there but you could also show the end game screen of each game that i think that will finalize and let people know that game is over we're not going to go back to that game it's done i think it'll help clear up some of the confusion of all the clips jumping back and forth. So any game that ended with the final kill, just for a moment, just show the scoreboard. I don't know if this one did. No, this one didn't, the cold one. I mean, the the the, the Mount Ormond didn't yet. I think only this one did, the cold one farm, and then this one here, Crotus Pren. But you get what I'm saying? Like when it's the final kill here, right there, instead of showing me like standing there at the hook right here i mean you could but i feel like it should show just for a moment here end screen and then you can do this uh swipe transition back to um now we're back on mount ormond well they're on this gen all right we get hits on people go to the middle so that way we're showing the I think we're done pretending to be a finalization game. of each game. So everybody sees that game's over. Everyone's dead in that game. Teabag me. That right there, her teabag could probably be like a, a little more clear because it happens right when this cut happens. She does one teabag. So back here, she gets hit. You could probably cut right here sooner can leave that audio of her like crying right here boom the hit and then you could leave this audio but show the next clip sooner where you see her standing there because you almost don't notice she teabags it happens so quickly so if you bring this video this clip drag it a little to the left so you see more of it you'll clearly see her teabag me right here you almost don't see it because it happens right when you cut the clip the teabag happens so quickly so you can get rid of some of this and you see like you see it but you get what i'm saying it happens so fast after the right there see the the clip cuts right here it cuts and there's like one two three four five six seven eight nine frames eight frames before she teabags once so if this clip were sooner, you would see her standing there. You could probably even zoom in on her and just show the tea bag and then zoom out. So it'd be like, so you'd start where you're like, um, this actually, let me reposition it. You could start off like there and you would show the tea bag. Well, lined up more center rather, but you would see the, uh, so right, you would cut here and you would see the, the tea bag like more up close, a you know, little position like center kind of, you would see the tea bag and then it would zoom out to, bag me. to full screen.
you definitely want to, the reason I'm saying this, you definitely want to emphasize them teabagging me as much as possible because people are going to comment on the video and be like, oh, she only teabagged once. You shouldn't have been so, you shouldn't have killed her and been so hard on her. Or the teabaggers, they were just doing that to be friendly. Or so what? They teabagged one time. It's not like they were really bullying you. Like it's going to get comments like that probably. So you really want to exaggerate and, and emphasize all the teabagging. Even though in this case, sometimes survivors do teabag once to try to be friendly or try to ask, but to try to be nice. So the teabagging is misinterpreted a lot. But in any case, for sake of this video, we want to make it look like they were toxic. Because people are going to say they weren't that toxic to you. They were just trying to communicate. Cut her off. Give him a smack. Give him a down. There you are. Down that one. Oh, he's got endurance. Okay. Down you go. This is all good because it down shows. You uh, you it's. You still want to play your flashlight game? It just flows really well. You want to start doing gens? Down you go. Any more tea bags? Where's the last one? Oh, the last one's over here. Hi. All right, see this clip here where I'm saying, where's the last one? Any more tea bags? That's actually fine because it's like I'm looking for them. You want to start doing gens? <laughs> Down you go. So, right here, normally I would say, like, don't show this because it's just me walking around. But because I'm saying, where's the last one? I'm looking for them. Uh, it, it makes sense because I'm looking around. Any more tea bags? Where's the last one? Oh, last one's. See, that makes perfect sense because I'm like, where's the last one? And I'm looking, turning my head. So that's why that kind of works. But otherwise, I would probably say cut to this clip already, uh, leaving the audio, of course. But Down cutting to that, go. cutting to that clip sooner. Oh, any more tea bags? But this is fine. How this is? Where's the last one? Oh, last one's over here. It actually works good because I say, where's the last one? I don't see her. And then she runs by and says, last one's over here. So th that's a fine edit. Hi. Surprise. Now what? Da -da -da. And see how the, the thing popped up in the diverse despair challenge popped up in the left again, but it stayed there and it looks natural. So that one's not a problem. It doesn't flicker like the other ones. Da -da 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 -da. Yellow. That one flickered, it looked like. That one's good. This one flickers real fast. I'm guessing it's just the game, you know? Maybe that has nothing to do with you editing. That that just looks like the game doing that. Because there's no edit here, and it just flickers like that. So if you can't change, if you can't fix any of those, don't worry about them. That's, like, that's out of your control if you can't. It, if it was something you did with the edit, that's one thing. But if it's just in the game, just let it be. It's just weird how this one shows and then this one doesn't. It just flickers and goes away. Oh, one of them is up again. Okay. At first I thought it was you. your editing, you but you I think it's the, the game. <laughs> Surprise. Not too greedy, yeah. You got your reassurance. Make sure. Oh, okay. Nice, nice. What happened there? Want a tea bag? Want to bring out your flashlights? Come on, give me some flashlight blinds. Give me some tea bags. Surprise! I I lost count of the hooks. I don't think we've hooked you. Uh, right right there is a little sound clip after she gets hooked. I, I lost count of the hooks. The sound can, needs to be faded in there because it just cuts in the, the sound of her dying on the hook right here. It just comes out of nowhere and it has like a little pop sound to it. Like right after it cuts to this clip, right when it cuts to this clip. Surprise! I, I lost count right of here. the hooks. That could be faded better, the audio. I think we've hooked you yet. Throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it. You gotta be quicker than that, buddy. This time we're gonna hook you. I actually hit you, huh? 
Oh, your flashlights. Come on. Hello. Uh, that clip, what you could do right here. Oh, your. Uh, as I pull, as I hold the Black. blink, you could zoom in on him right here, like real quickly, like, you know, just a quick, well, faster than that, but it would just be like a quick zoom right on him. So you see him on the balcony up there right here, like it zooms in on him as he's running away. Come on. So that, that way, when you transition here, it just looks like a manual transition. Cause it just looks like kind of weird how I, you, huh? I go to hold a blink oh, here but then Come i'm just on. up there maybe you could create the transition by quickly zooming in to him up there or something and then suddenly i'm i'm right here i don't know not not that important i would just try to make that look more smooth but it's once again not a big deal at all minor things hello no. What I do in those situations where things don't look like 100% smooth is I just try something. And I try something different. Like like I said, a zoom in up there or something. Uh, some kind of different edit. And it either works or it doesn't. And if it doesn't work, I maybe try another thing. I try like one or two or three things to see if I can get it to work. And sometimes I'm like, oh, wow, that looks great. And I did something creative that works that I like, or it just doesn't work and nothing I'm doing works. And at that case, I just leave it how it was or just pick the best one out of the three. Like I don't get stuck too long trying to do. Okay. I'm lying. Sometimes I get stuck way longer than I should. But the point is I try a few different things. Just try something creative. Let me see if this works. Let me see if that works. Let me chop it here differently let, let me zoom in there let me put a static transition let me whatever just something and sometimes i surprise myself and something works and i'm like oh that's great it's perfect and other times i'm like i struggle and i have a hard time getting something that looks smoother oh your flashlights come on hello no but I know you're creative with stuff because I've seen your edits and sometimes you just do things that I would have never even thought of. And I'm like, wow, that's awesome. Like, for instance, that one that I was saying where in the previous game uh, where the screaming was like, ah, and it just like zoomed around chasing. Uh, that was in the other edit with the Twitch streamers that like that thought the nurse was pretty anything. Just I'm just giving an, an example, but things like that, any different thing. And obviously all the memes that you throw in. Uh, a lot of times you just do things I would never think of that are great. Claudette's here. She's making all that noise. She wants me to chase her. She's like, I'm a big shot. So I forgot to mention once again, at the end of this, he's the last one. Show the scoreboard, all of them dead, something. Or, sorry, she's the last one right there. So it, you might have to add two seconds to the video, but it'll be fine because of all the other sections where we cut off like five, five or ten seconds here. So maybe for two seconds, just show the scoreboard like before it comes here. Like, I'm a big shot. Same thing on all, like I said, same thing. Every time a game ends and the last person dies, show something that finalizes it and says that game is done. They're all dead. Let's go down together. So this right here, after I hook her, I turn and look at the gen. It's okay. It's just maybe have this clip sooner because it's like I turn and look at the gen and I probably went to kick it, but you don't see that. So what's the point of just showing me look at the gen? I guess kind of it's fine. It's another one of those like it's a fine edit, but it could be better. Like it, maybe it could show the next clip sooner. Cause I walk up to the gen, but maybe it can show this clip a little sooner or something. I don't know. Not a big deal, but sometimes it's just the flow of an edit could, I feel like could be a little smoother. 
Let's go down together. It's not bad. Right there you are. Take a smack, my dear. Claudette's right here. Do you still think I'm a baby? This is the grab, the window grab coming up. That's the window grab that I'm saying in the beginning should, uh, when I say, little did they know I was the one trolling them. Because it's like the tables have turned and it shows me grab her off the window. I think that would be a good clip for that part. How about down here, Thalita? Will you DC if I put you down here? Tell me you're still down here, really? This part kind of confused me after I hooked her. If I put you down here. Because I don't know what happened. I just see like Claudette running up the stairs. Uh, I guess she unhooked her because the lead is not if on the I hook. If I put you down here. See, the lead is on the hook there. But then if you look at the left, she's no, she's no longer on the hook. So I guess... Uh, um, Claudette unhooked her. That part's a little weird because it's hard to tell like what happened. It just shows it shows me hook the lead in the basement, but then immediately shows me chasing Claudette out of the basement. So I don't really know what happened. If there's any way to like make that a little more obvious, fine. If not, it's not the end of the world. I mean, you're still down. It's just kind of like confusing to know what happened in the game. Down here, really. Oh, look at that. They're on the last gen now. And then when she's running from really? me. I guess that's fine. This is fine. Oh, look at that. That's fine. They're on the last gen now. That ed that edit's a little weird right there. Because oh, I, I I grab a blink, like I'm I'm ready to last charge a blink. Gen. But then it just shows me immediately like coming out of a blink but it could just be that you that i missed a bunch of blinks and you just cut to the scene once again i would just try to make it flow a little oh, look at that let me see they're on the last gen no maybe right he maybe cut it right here as i'm holding the blink so it looks like i'm just letting go of that first blink so oh look at that right here the, i'm charging a blink right last gen no. Claudette runs behind the tree, and before I let go of this blink, you could probably cut. You can leave the cut. <coughs> Sorry, you could probably leave the cut right here. But instead of cutting to here, where I'm like charging another blink, you could cut to like right where I'm about to let go, like right about. I don't know if it should be the lit up one or the frame where it doesn't light up. I don't know what'll look cooler if it's lit up like right here because it's going to flicker. It's going to be like lit up, but then not lit up. But if you take it back here, the hand is lit up right here. So like right as she's going behind that tree, like where you cut <clears throat> and the hand is ready to blink, you can take this out right here and just have it where it's like right about either here or there depending on what looks smoother with the light on the hand or not but it'll just cut it'll look like she's holding a blink right here ready to blink the nurse and then the blink that happens comes right here so it just jumps from one location to another but it'll look smoother Oh, look at that. <laughs> It'll look a lot smoother than now. this because the problem here is you see this part where it's like I'm coming out of a fatigue and it doesn't make any sense because a moment ago my hand's up ready to blink, but now all of a sudden my hand's down. That needs to be cut out and it just needs to show my hand back up ready for the final blink. Like I said, I don't know if this frame would work like here. Or it might just look weird because it, it flickers from glowing to not. But I don't know how it would transition. You'd have to actually just see. It'd probably be better to cut. Honestly, it'd probably be better the way I look at it. It would probably be better to cut to right to this frame where the hand's not glowing anymore. And it'll just be an immediate hit. And that would make that edit look smoother. 
I'm pretty sure about that, just from what I see. No touching the leader. Kate, don't do it. Bad idea, Kate. Don't do that. Claudette is healed up. Let me just make sure they're not touching this gen. Oh, yep, what do you know? We found it. Well, don't teabag a nurse is all I can tell you. You wanted attention, Lolita. Oh, she's teabagging more, okay. Man, they just never learn. Yeah, you thought you had a baby nurse, didn't you? And so this one, you actually did show the end screen as the end of the video, basically. But um, yeah. the thing is, Claudette's still alive there. You can see on the left, yeah. Claudette's not dead yet. Uh, you th thought you had a so maybe baby? after uh, I hook her and, I, and I'm saying, yeah, you thought you had a baby nurse? Yeah. Like right here? You thought as I'm saying, you thought you had a baby nurse. Maybe it should show me hooking Claudette for the final time. You had a baby nurse. So I'm pretty sure she died, right? No, baby girl Ash. Maybe she didn't die. Maybe she got the hatch. Well, whatever the case, if she did, if she got the hatch, then that's fine. But um. If she died, make sure you show me killing her at the end here. But I'm guessing maybe she got hatch or something. And um, and then this is the end. Nurse, didn't you? I don't know what the end of this game was, but it was one of the other ones, I guess. <clears throat> oh, a little P1 nurse with nothing. <laughs> I guess you can leave this end as is. If you had any other, if they said anything else in the comments that were salty in any of the other games, like any stuff like this, you should show that too, like when the games end. Um, yeah, I don't know which game this was. A nurse with nothing. <laughs> You guys weren't that bad. It wasn't like I wasn't getting teabagged a bunch or anything. I think I got like a couple of squats. Okay, well, that's an in depth review right there. That was an hour and 22 minutes. All right, you got it.